Hey, what's going on guys? This is Kedar here. And today in this video, I have got some fantastic news to share with you. $2,000 sports stimulus check targeted for social security, SSDI, SSI, low income, seniors, and people with disabilities. Let's say in the event of another round of stimulus check approval, fixed income beneficiaries will be going to receive the checks. Once the bill is signed into the law, it generally takes one week to reach the stimulus check into your bank account or deposited into your mails what about us what's really going on what about the seniors what about the older adults and what about the fixed income beneficiaries now it's a definitely a fair concern i hear from you yes you are included in a two thousand dollar port stimulus check yes you heard it right government is now looking into exploring a new idea of providing automatic two thousand dollars monthly stimulus check for low income citizens your financial well-being is is the top most priority and that's where we are going to ensure that you have the necessary information your necessary benefits your necessary insights to make the decisions for yourselves and your loved ones this one is specially aimed for fixed income beneficiaries that's right we are talking about all of those group of people who are living on social security retirement disability ssdi survivors ssi beneficiaries va rrb low income seniors older adults and of course people with disabilities it's a deal that is going to impact whopping 70 million plus beneficiaries across our great nation so without further ado let's deep dive into all the details but however guys before we do a quick shout out to all of you who are joining us for the first time if you haven't yet already subscribed make sure to subscribe it's completely free to do so by subscribing you'll be joining onto the journey to stay informed and empowered onto the latest update and crucial information that's hitting the news each and every day that affects your money your benefits your lifestyle so without a further ado let's jump right into all the details and let's understand what's really going on now i definitely understand that many of you had a burning question and concerns but trust me guys i've been reading through all of your comments and i'm here to address all the questions head on and get on with it many of you have been asking where we currently stand especially those who are on a fixed income fixed income beneficiaries you are worried about whether you'll be in included into the new wave of the stimulus check support i have got some answers coming your way but first let me quickly touch upon few recent topics that have been making the news so have you ever heard about the child tax credit payments they are talking about reinstating this payments and there is a recent discussions going on regarding it these are the list of states which have approved there are 14 states out of 50 states which are offering the assistance more details coming from the congress congress is considered to expand the child tax credit into the 2024 potentially benefiting the lowest income families now i know many of you not here directly apply for it but here is the thing it's always a hot topic nonetheless and it's one of those topic issues that often have some brightful wondering what about us what's really going on what about the seniors what about the older adults and what about the fixed income beneficiaries now it's a definitely a fair concern i hear from you there are lots of things happening out there into the economy and sometimes it can feel like certain group of beneficiaries are consistently left out and that's why i wanted to take a moment to address a crux of this video that's why we are here to talk about the potential two thousand dollar port stimulus check update however there is an economic climate which is showing some signs that there is a strain into the economy that usually sets a stage for additional financial support now i know many of you have been asking whether you'll be included this time when the fourth stimulus check will be announced and i have seen those concerns showing up brewing into the comment sections for years now and believe me guys i get it but here is the thing the fear of being left out can be a very realistic one especially when we have seen these things happening before but here is the thing guys when it comes down to the stimulus check and various benefit programs there is a very important point you need to understand typically uh, there is an income based criteria it's a about whether your income falls below a specific threshold or not so let's address the elephant into the room now remember that one time with the child tax credit payment yeah it wasn't exactly tailored for the fixed income beneficiaries and that was truly frustrating and we get it like i know it's frustrating no one likes feeling being left out but here is the thing guys i wanted to reassure you that you need the eligibility criteria for those while receiving the financial aids generally the income based threshold are the 
the one which are implemented so unless there is some unusual clause excluding a specific group of people is included now i know no one likes feeling left out but the reassurance you need is the eligibility criteria for the financial aids well here is the thing those financial aids generally come as a income based criteria so unless there is some weird clause excluding a specific group of people which is i doubt highly unlikely you are most likely included and therefore one of the critical aspect to consider is how these programs are structured around income thresholds income thresholds are very much important and you see when lawmakers pass these bills they often attach a specific income limits in order to determine who is eligible and who is not so let's break it down further now talking about the recent stimulus numbers those numbers were based on income thresholds for instance for individuals it was somewhere around $75000 while for married couples it was about $150000 dollar threshold similarly for certain other stimulus program these thresholds could vary but the underlying principle remains the same so if your income falls below a set threshold then you are considered eligible for these benefits now before you start worrying let me reassure you that when we talk about these thresholds and the fixed income beneficiaries the majority of them typically fell well below this income limits and yes there might be a small exception for this one small group of people like some receiving social security retirement beneficiaries might still be working and they are earning substantial amount of income as well but for the vast majority of people this isn't a concern to worry about so in the case of the future round of stimulus check it is highly highly likely that you are likely going to be included and i definitely understand that it can be disheartening at some times to feel like you are being left out of the loop all the rounds of stimulus check and we have been seen it happen before and it's not a pleasant thing but here is the thing guys rest assured the idea of excluding a significant portion of the population from such aid is highly unlikely for especially for the fixed income beneficiaries and the goal is to ensure that those who truly need the benefits the assistance can access those financial aid those benefits regardless of the source of their income now whether it's coming from the job small business or any other revenue source whether it comes from stock market bonds income is income and that is what matters right over here now let's talk a bit about the broader economic landscape that we have been seen now we have seen our fair share of the market crashes and economic downturns over the past few years and guess what happens each and every time when economy takes a downturn well it's the same old tested strategy of printing out bunch of money and sending it to the people in forms of various stimulus packages and it's a pattern that has been around for decades it's not likely going to change anytime soon in fact here is the thing with each successive crash the amount of the money pumped into the system seems to increase each and every time now to put this simply uh, there is a strong likelihood that we will be going to continue seeing those financial aids coming especially during those turbulent hard times and i know there are a lot of concern into the government section particularly i hear that whether i will be included or not but here is the thing rest assured if you fall within a certain income threshold then you will be definitely definitely included i'm here to keep you up to date on all the latest developments whether there is any new update regarding the stimulus check on federal level state level whether it's about your monthly benefits proposed bills packages or any changes to the economic landscape that might affect your finances before you get too excited let me clarify that as of right now no fourth stimulus check have been approved no specific dollar amount has been approved 